My guide, Tulani Mabaso, was a political prisoner here himself for 12 years. The section where you are is B section, where most of our leaders, former president of South Africa, Nelson Mandela, was kept in this particular cell. There's a key, master key. Wow, it's tiny. I mean, I could reach from one side to the other. What kind of conditions did they have in here? Conditions were bad, horrible. This place is freezing. Yeah. You don't have enough blankets. That mat is very hard. Your body became pain. And all he had was... That's a toilet, a bucket. The bucket was his toilet. He used to use the bench as a table. There is a massive concrete wall here, and all you see is the sky. So for 18 years, mm. this was his view. And how was the relationship between the prison guards and Mandela, or the political leaders that were here? All our guards were racist. All the guards were white. Their mission was to oppress everyone. Sometimes they come at night and make them to remove all this blanket outside, stand naked in the cell, in this cold place. Discrimination in this country was horrible. Undermining you, pushing you down. Do you think Mandela would be proud of South Africa and how far we've come as a country today? He was proud then. Yeah. He'd still be proud now. When he see us rolling, called the Young Lions. My dad was really inspired by Nelson Mandela. And so he named me and my sisters the Three Young Lions. Three Young Lions, yeah. And he says, when you go overseas, you better roar mm -hmm. and make them know that you're South African and how strong you are. Exactly. So we're going to make them shake, because yeah. we're going to roar. Shake them. You shake them. <laughs> yeah. I mean, thank you so much for this. This is a big part of history, the sacrifice that you made for our freedom, for people especially like me, who are born free. I'm nothing but thankful and grateful and humbled to be in your presence. Just Thank you. even be in his cell and hold the key in my hands. This place where it makes me really, really, really angry because people were imprisoned and, and tortured and treated terribly and abused and disrespected and disregarded. But they were political leaders. They were heroes. Nelson Mandela was treated like a terrorist, and he had to be jailed for 27 years to make an impact. <laughs>